I just keep reminding myself to kind of be free of all of my own expectations and the pressures that a typical athlete faces. And I just try to remind myself, uh, go out there, have fun, uh, smile on the court, and just uh, be myself, be free, and, and be really aggressive. I'm Jeremy Lin, I'm a point guard for the Houston Rockets, and this is a day in the life, game day. There's so much stuff that you need to do every day to maintain your physical health. My biggest thing is energy. If I have a lot of energy in my legs, I play better defense and get more steals. I run more in transition. My jumpers uh, tend not to be short. I focus so much on making sure that I have enough energy in my legs, enough juice to play the way I want to that night. I think the key is just to keep building, keep building, keep building, and uh, it's great when you see like hope, when you see potential, and you know now we're starting to kind of achieve the things that we had been talking about earlier. You know the games that we let slip early in the season, some of those we're starting to close now, so it's really nice to see that. We just finished shoot around. Nash and Kobe Bryant are pretty good, so we learned this morning. <laughs> Houston driving is basically 20 million freeways. If you go the speed limit, you'll be one of the fastest cars on the freeway. Everything is slow out here, man. It's the way I like it. Now I'm gonna go back, I'm gonna eat my omelet. Omelet flow. Ham, tomato, mushroom, peppers, onions. One of my more recent hobbies that I started this year is just learning to play the piano. I only know about three songs right now. Basically on game days, I try to do um, as much as nothing as possible until like right before the game. And I try to save all my energy. All right, it's time for my nap. I'll see you in four hours. I normally shift into game mode when I wake up after my nap. I spend about 30 minutes to an hour and I kind of just read my Bible and pray about the game and what I want to accomplish that night. If we don't win, I'm never making one of these YouTube videos again. I had to go into the game with a certain mindset. Be free on the court, have fun on the court, and smile a lot when I'm out there. If I have that mindset, you know, everything will happen instinctually. I try to make sure that I play my game and uh, I feel like when I do that, I'll be all right and uh, I don't have to worry about who I'm necessarily going up against. I think when I focus too much on the other person, I lose sight of you know what I need to do myself. When I come out to warm up at the 20 minute mark, um, when there's 20 minutes left before tip off, we come out as a team, we come through the tunnel. That's when everything just turns into business mode and it's all about getting my body going and I try to get a full sweat before the game. So by the time the game starts, I'm done warming up. Chandler proposed the idea of making a really creative handshake and then James saw it and, and uh, we thought it'd be a great idea, the three of us, if we all got in and kind of made one together. So now we have a three-person thing going right before tip-off. Ahead to Jeremy Lin, one on three, attacks Meeks, goes right to the rim, lays it up and in. Once the game starts, it's pretty much all like a blur. Stutter steps, ball worked over, middle world piece to the rim, the layup. Not too much is going on in my mind besides what's going on in that game. I try to make sure that I, I play my game, and uh, I feel like when I do that, I'll be all right. Rebound tapped it to Lynn, press 24, and Lynn will raise up for a three in the air. He hits! Rockets now with their biggest lead of the game. The standing ovation from this sellout crowd here tonight in Houston. If you have that mindset where you're going to be aggressive and just be yourself, everything comes a lot more natural and free. pumps out nitrogen and makes the temperature negative 170 degrees Celsius and then all the blood rushes to your heart and then when you get out the blood rushes back to the rest of your body and it creates massive regeneration. We 
got a big win tonight against the Lakers. We're uh, headed to the airport right now. Um, fly to New Orleans. We're going to play there tomorrow. So uh, thanks for following me today. Uh, day in the life, game day.